How to install rubber close cell elastomeric insulation in tube and sheet form. Proper installation is critical to the insulation system's performance. We shall make different cuts and demonstrate how to install the elastomeric insulation on bends. We shall make 2 piece 90, 3 piece 90 and a 3 piece T. Prerequisites for the installation of elastomeric insulation. This is glue called Golfo glue. Brushes, a sharp knife and a Golfo template. Cut the elastomeric insulation at 135 degrees followed by the straight cut for a two-piece 90. This is a two-piece 90. Now for three-piece 90, cut at 112.5 degrees, then at 67.5 degrees, followed by the straight cut. This is a three-piece 90. For a three-piece T, cut an angle of 135 degrees, then at 45 degrees, followed by the straight cut of 90 degrees. This is a three-piece T. Using the brush, apply Golfo glue on the surfaces to be joined. Leave it for two minutes. Now join the two pieces smoothly so that no air will pass through it. Cover the elbows with two piece 90 and three piece 90. Install three-piece T over the copper pipe. Installation technique for pre-slit, pre-glued elastomeric insulation. Place the tube over the copper pipe. From one end, scratch and remove the releasing paper. Join the tube by soft and smooth hands longitudinally. This is a seam joint. Apply Golfo glue. Leave it for two minutes. Join the two pipes from the edges. This is a butt joint. Demonstration of rubber closed cell elastomeric insulation sheet. This is an elastomeric insulation sheet with self adhesive. And this is without self adhesive. Application of sheet with self adhesive. Scratch and remove the releasing paper from elastomeric insulation sheet. Paste it with soft hands. Application of sheet without self adhesive. Apply Golfo glue gently on the sheet surface. Leave it for two minutes. 
paste the sheet with soft hands. <laughs> 